It's another Friday and it's time to take stocks on the close of equities at the Nigerian capital market. Welcome to After the Bell. Market activities closed week but with the bulls in the lead. Two of the trading days in the week significantly accounted for the sustained uptrend realized. Owing to the huge transactions witnessed in the stocks of Union Bank PLC, the market had some remarkable volume turnover. And now we go through the tables. The All Share Index stepped up by 0.96% to close at 21,599.57. The market capitalization appreciated by 65.37 billion naira to close at 6.89 trillion naira. Union Bank PLC led the traded stocks in the market with 4.32 billion units of stocks. Transco had 298.56 million and Diamond Bank PLC closed with 69.83 million units. This week, the financial services sector led other sectors by 91%. Conglomerates contributed 5.58% trades to the volume of stocks traded in the market. And by weekly analysis, the sectoral indices had appreciations in three sectors. The food and beverages had 1.48% northward move as the insurance sector and the oil and gas recorded declines. And with 30 gainers and 34 decliners, Pinscom PLC has the highest gains by 25.66% to close at 1 Naira 91 Kobo. RT Brisco PLC had 43 Kobo gains and Evans Medical PLC closed at 67 Kobo. However, there were declines in the stocks of GT Ashore by 10.88%, Portland Paints shed 25 Kobo, while Avon Crown PLC dropped from 3 Naira 1 Kobo to 2 Naira 81 Kobo. Corporate declarations come from six companies this week. Kuseda Insurance PLC declared a positive gross earning of 5.36 billion Naira for the financial year ended December 2011. Niger Insurance PLC for the same financial year made public a positive profit after tax of 1.22 billion Naira. However, Academy Press PLC recorded a 21.6% decline in its profit after tax. For further details on equities this week at the exchange, do check out our news and features page where you can get the text version of our market reports for the week. But in whatever you do, keep giving your stocks the long-term investment approach. Thank you for being with us on After the Bell. Have a lovely weekend.